Today, we are going to talk about bladder and bowel preparation for radiation therapy. If you are being treated for prostate cancer, your doctor may ask you to use the restroom and drink a certain amount of water before each of your treatments. This will help make sure radiation doesn't go to parts of the body that don't need it. When you have a full bladder during treatment, it helps keep the bladder away from radiation. It also pushes the small bowel out of the way. Similarly, an empty rectum will keep the rectum away from radiation and will help make sure the prostate stays in the same place each day. Before your treatment starts, you will have an appointment called a CT simulation, where you will be asked to empty and fill your bladder before having a CT scan. This scan will be used to plan your radiation treatment. When you arrive to this appointment, a radiation therapist will have you use the restroom and then drink anywhere from 16 to 32 ounces, about two to four cups of water. It takes at least 15 minutes after drinking for your bladder to fill, so it is important you arrive on time. The goal is to make your bladder comfortably full. This means you could feel like you need to go, but can easily wait until after your scan is done. If you have trouble holding your bladder, please let the staff know. You will be asked to drink the same amount of water before all your treatments. If this amount needs to change, the therapist will help you. Remember, you will need to finish drinking no less than 15 minutes before your treatment time. If you do not, you may have to wait. We have water and restrooms if you need them. If you cannot have a bowel movement at some point before your treatment, or are having trouble passing gas, your doctor may suggest taking a laxative or gas relief agent. Limiting or avoiding foods and drinks that can cause gas or bloating, like nuts and soda, could also be helpful. If you have regular bowel movements before treatment, you should not need to make any changes. Be sure to talk to your doctor or nurse before you start taking any new supplements or making any big changes to your diet. If you have any questions, please ask. We are here to help.